Hello there and welcome to video number eight. This video is on the order of operations uh, and I've written BODMAS next to that for a reason. So operations, the four main operations are uh, adding, subtracting, multiplying, dividing, but in, in this we're including uh, orders or powers um, uh, and, and brackets as well. Okay, so um, BODMAS is the thing that helps us guide our understanding of the order in which we solve a maths problem. Okay, um, and it's always used. We always use it. Um, and I've put, be careful you don't fall into the common traps that people fall into. And the common trap is that people think you have to do the division before the multiplication. Um, and you have to do the addition before the subtraction. Okay, uh, whereas you could switch the multiplication with the division and you could switch the subtraction with the addition, um, they are interchangeable. Okay, so it's it's kind of this this bit here is interchangeable with this bit, these two are interchangeable, and this bit here, that those two are interchangeable. Okay, but what you do have to follow is that is done first, that is done second, these are done third, these are done fourth, effectively. Okay, um, yeah, so here we go with some questions. Let's try and follow the order in which we solve our uh, math problem mass problems with uh, this bod mass business so question 1a is 2 plus 5 plus 10 divided by 5 now there's some brackets in it so we do 10 divided by 5 and that will give us 2 and then what we do is we write out the problem I won't do it for all the problems um, but we write out the problem as it is again okay and then we just see what we've got left and we're just adding so we can just add from left to right so 2 plus 5 is 7 plus 2 is 9 so our final answer to that question there is 9 okay um, again we've got brackets in this one so we're going to do 12 here because 4 times 3 is 12 and then minus 3 times by 2 which is 6 and then 12 take away 6 is 6 so it's pretty quick once you know what you're doing um, and then we've got this one here where we've just got adding and subtracting now like I said you can interchange the subtraction and the addition all right there is nothing else in here so we're just going to start from the left and we're going to go to the right some people would try and do it in different ways and get themselves all muddled up you can just go from left to right here so 10 take away 6 is 4 plus 2 is 6 take away 5 is 1 plus 7 is 8 and then take away 8 is nothing so we have nothing left um, after all that that was a pain right in question number two uh, we have to work out what this is now this is a fraction okay we get a number on the top and a number on the bottom it is a fraction uh, and it's a division so this bit 3 plus 9 is done before dividing it by 2 uh, because effectively this line here this fraction line acts as a bracket okay so we just do this bit and we do this bit if there's something to do here there isn't it's just the number 2 so um, I'm not going to do a number 2 uh, so 3 plus 9 is 12 and 12 I'll write this one out over 2 is 12 divided by 2 and that is 6 okay and uh, this one is a lot more complicated looking but it's exactly the same principle so let's just write down what we've got here I'm just going to put equals 3 times 5 because we've got brackets I'm going to do this bracket I'm going to do this bracket everything on the top first and then I'm going to work up what this is on the bottom so that's going to give us 15 and we're going to have to take away whatever 20 divided by 2 is and 20 divided by 2 is uh, 10 okay uh, and then we are all over the square root of 100 and square root of 100 if you watch the types of number video you'll understand that um, what a square number is and maybe not necessarily a square root now square root is the opposite of a square number square root of 100 is 10 so we're going to divide by 10 if we do 15 take away 10 we have to do that first that gives us 5 out of 10 and 5 out of 10 is a fraction that we can simplify simplify down to one half okay so there's my final answer for that question uh, it takes a few steps sometimes um, now in question three I've included one with a power uh, it's just in a long line again it's the same process it's nothing too taxing um, if you're all right with with you know calculations and doing multiplications and divisions and squaring things so in the brackets we've got 30 times by 18 so that's a little bit tricky we could use our Chinese box method of multiplication we could use whatever we wanted uh, but I'm just gonna do 3 times by 18 right if you're not sure what 3 times 18 is 3 times 10 is 30 3 times 8 is 24 so we add those two answers together we get 54 but remember we weren't uh, doing 3 times 18 we were doing 30 times 18 so 540 is what we end up with 
uh, there. Then we're going to add on the 12 divided by the 3 times by the 2 plus the 6 squared, right? Now, we need to do the 6 squared next according to this order of operation. So I'm going to write down 540 plus 12 divided by 3 multiplied by 2 plus 36, okay? And then um, I can just go through and do the division and then the multiplication bits. So I've got four, uh, 540 plus 12 divided by 3, which is 4, and then 4 multiplied by 2 is 8. So I just did both those bits at the same time. Saves a bit of hassle. And then we just add our numbers across here. So um, again, it doesn't matter what order really we do it in, but we go from left to right. So 548. Um, if we add 6 on to 548, we get 554. Uh, and then we add 30 onto that. So 500 and... I'm rubbish at adding, aren't I? Terrible. I'm going to write it out. For, uh, 8 and 36. Yeah, I don't like it. So we're going to add that and that and that's seven that's eight 584 i did think it was 584 but i'm under pressure i've just put five this is terrible 584 there we go got it right in the end so um yeah order of operations and uh, again click the link for um practice to these it's in the description section and like and subscribe if you are so inclined to um it would be lovely if you did because then you'd get a lot better at maths um by practicing that's all it's going to take all right I'm not saying i'm i'm the be all and end all of listening uh of 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 math explanations um but yeah it might work hopefully cheers then